Welcome to my presentation. In this presentation, we shall see more about augmented matrix and coefficient matrix. In our previous example, we have seen how to write system of uh, how to write augmented matrix and coefficient matrix from a given system of linear equations. If we are given an augmented matrix, we should be able to write a system of linear equations from that. For example, let me explain this with an example. Let us say we have an augmented matrix like this. 4, negative 5, 5, negative 2, 3, 1, like that. We want to be able to write the system of linear equations for this type of a augmented matrix. So the way to do that is as follows. Since we know that the first term it represents is, is the coefficient for x and the second term is a, is a coefficient for y and if we want to we can write them on top of uh, those numbers indicating that we are, we, are, we are picking up the right variable term when we are looking at the, at the coefficient term. So the way we can write the first equation is 4x minus 5y is equal to 5. That is the first system of linear equation. And the second system of linear equation is negative 2x plus 3y is equal to 1. That is the second equation. So the point here is when we are given a system of linear equations, we should be able to write the augmented matrix and the coefficient matrix. But, and given the augmented matrix, we should be able to do, uh, we should be able to recognize the system of linear equations from, from that. We will use these in solving problems uh, in, uh, as, we, as we advance into this uh, um, playlist. Okay. Let us take another example. This was a system of linear equations in two variables. Let us see if we can apply the same concept to a system of linear equations in three variables. Let us say we have an augmented matrix of this kind. 3, 0, negative 7, 2. I'm just making up some numbers. Negative 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, negative 2, 8, and 4. Let us say we have an augmented matrix of this kind and we want to be able to recognize the system of linear equations from this augmented matrix. So let us write down the, the x, y, and z on top of these, uh, on top of this um, the matrix here. The first will, on the first row, that is the, those are the coefficients of x, and then the second row, the second column, the first column, those are the coefficients of x, the second column, those are the coefficients of y. In the third column, those are the coefficients of z. So we'll start writing this uh, uh, system of linear equations now. If for the first equation, it will be 3x plus 0y, or we don't need to even write that, but we'll just write it out for now. 3x plus 0y minus 7z is equal to 2. That is our first equation. The second equation is negative 2x plus 3y plus 4z is equal to 5. That is our second equation. And our third equation is 6x minus 2y plus 8z is equal to 4. This is our third equation. So from an augmented matrix, we were able to write the system of linear equations. And this is a system of linear equations in three variables. And the three variables here are x, y, and z. Okay. In my next presentation, we shall see how to produce a matrix uh, a row operation, how to perform a row operation um, given a matrix.